Here is your animal. Now, what would you like to call her? Milkshake. Oh, a fine name. Suitable for any lady.
If my mom knew that someone played into... I got your letter. I'll put on a romantic dinner for you and Amira. Just bring me some ingredients. Some mushrooms and a tuna should do it. Have you got the ingredients? I sure have. Great. Come to the diner tomorrow night and I'll have everything prepared. Do you know who your secret gift recipient is yet? Mine's Kai. I'm thinking of getting him a soft foam top shortboard. But really, that's more of a gift for myself.
Here is your amp. Now, what would you like to call her? Little Tara. Mm-hmm, that's exactly what... Tara, if it's no trouble, can I speak to you for a moment? Sure, what's up? I want to help Messenger Cameron prove that the League is a force for good in the community. I feel badly, you know, about Sophia. I still can't explain what happened. It's not just about weeding out the malcontents. We can help our neighbors in other ways. Anyway, Cameron wants to start a new charity initiative. A soup kettle. We'll be offering free soup to anyone in the community who wants it. That's a wonderful idea. I thought you'd like it. Of course, we're gonna need a really big pot. I'll take any copper you have to spare. Once I've got enough, I can hammer out the soup kettle. Been in the mines lately? Yep. Here's your copper. Oh, wonderful. I'll get right to work and give this to Messenger Cameron tomorrow. Oh, if you have a moment to stop by the Consciousness Center, I know he'll want to thank you himself. I'm so stoked! Whew, but... Kim said, uh, uh, I. I smell new item on the menu I've been experimenting I'm adding some new authentic Italian dishes to the menu my husband was from Italy did you know that I never had the chance to visit his family he and Juliet went once to meet his grandmother when she was still alive have you traveled much Tara yes and I can't wait to go off somewhere again I get so bored being in the same place. Really? 
I'm never bored here. But then I'm more interested in people than in places. After they got back from Italy, Juliet would hardly talk to Giacomo. She said something about her great-grandmother being weird, but that was all. But Giacomo's grandmother didn't speak one word of English. She couldn't have said anything to offend Juliet. <sighs> Teenagers. My dad didn't talk to my grandpa for a long time, and he was hardly a teenager. They made up after I was born. Oh. Well, at least they patched things up before Robert passed. I wish Juliet and Giacomo had that closure. Always tell those you love how you feel about them, Tara. Don't wait. <laughs> Mother of this saves me so much time. You're a make last year. I I've checked in on Italia. She's... Uh... My, it smells amazing in here. Sophia, I can't wait to eat. It's delicious. Trust me. But first, I don't know if I can make it through this whole romantic meal if I don't know how you feel. Tara, I can't stop thinking about you. 
After Sahar, my ex from Tehran, ended things, I thought, there it goes. My only chance at real romance. But then you moved here, and I fell for you even faster than I fell for Sahar. So, there it is. I have said it, and now we can feast. I can't stop thinking about you either. It makes farm chores really difficult when I, um, I'm, uh, daydreaming about you. Oh. Oh, it makes me so happy. This is better than watching daytime TV. 